Yeah, I mean, I feel like everybody, especially artists, like we go through these periods of self doubt, which can be so um, debilitating. Uh, so I mean, Roger is somebody that I connect with because he's always like trying to write this song and he puts all this pressure on himself to like make this incredible art. And uh, that is something that, you know, I deal with sometimes and trying to find that balance between like want your expectations of yourself and allowing, you know, your creative energy to flow. And then at the same time, just, yeah, I think the struggle can make really incredible, incredible art as well. So. You know, I think for me, the things that I tend to struggle with most, they don't, they don't necessarily, they're not tangible in, in a monetary sense. I mean, look, I, my parents worked very hard uh, to provide a great deal for my, my, my brothers and I. I think the things that I've struggled with are, are issues of like self-love and, and loving yourself through the, the struggles of growth and believing in yourself. And I think those are the things that I struggle with most. And so fighting to have faith in, in my ability to honor, honor myself and honor the people around me. And and that manifests itself in so many different ways around us. Then we doubt that we can hold on to the job or that we can make the money to pay the rent or to provide for the family. Or to, you know, when you, when you doubt yourself, it makes it harder to provide for others. And uh, just, just fell in love with it. It, it, it. You've been talking about it for years. I actually used to make fun of him because he would. Um, well, honestly, for me, portraying Roger has been, I wouldn't say easy, but I can relate very much so to the character because for the last 12 years I've been living in Nashville as a professional songwriter in and out of publishing deals and doors opening and closing so I know exactly what the struggle is like to try to write the song and try to be an artist and get told no over and over and over, over again and wonder how you're gonna pay the mortgage and all that kind of stuff and and I'm a living testimony standing here with you today that if you believe and persist in anything you can get through anything and for me personally it was in my career as an artist, as an actor, and as a, a singer-songwriter, that this is this is actually a big break for me. So I'm standing here as proof that you know you you believe in what you do. You can you can get through anything in life. I'm with you. You're, you're allowed. Um, what do you think you'll be thinking about? Where do I start? I don't know. I mean, I think. I feel like anything that I've deeply struggled with, I still struggle with time to time. Your problems don't just go away. Um, you face them all the time. I used to have, this is so petty, but it's so funny how the things that, you know, maybe as when you were a teenager that you used to obsess over, whether it was you had acne or if you were overweight or whatever it was that made you despise yourself. If you gain a little bit of weight or you get one zit, you go crazy. That's like my thing that I'm always overcoming is being like, you're not 16. You know you're better than that. <laughs> And one time straight in Vanessa with the leg up right here, leg up. Oh, there you go, man.